27th August, this is two minutes in the Olive Garden. I'm Kofi Kofi Chisa. The word for today, Proverbs chapter 4, verse 1. Listen, my sons, to the instruction of a father and pay attention so that you may gain understanding. Please take a good look at yourself. Do you have a son or a daughter who is, say, 10, 9 years or even younger? Do you have a nephew or a niece or some child who is close to you at that age? I believe the answer is yes. Now, do you think that child knows how the world works better than you do? Is there any trick, any scheme or ways of outsmarting people that can be used by that child to outsmart you without you finding out? Well, this is exactly how your father or mother or an elder feels about you. When you come home late from school and lie about where you have been and your mom nods, do you really think she doesn't see through your lies? You think your dad did not see that lady you smuggled in to spend the night? Come on. Sometimes our elders allow these things so we can learn from our mistakes. Listen to your father, whether he is your biological father, a father in the faith, a mentor, even a spiritual father. Pay attention to their words, especially their proverbs. You need understanding. The Holy Spirit will deliberately deprive you of the wisdom that you should get from a father. So don't disrespect your father or ignore his good counsel and think the spirit of wisdom will give it to you. There is something about understanding that only a father can give. So be wise. The shalom of Yahweh be upon you.